Hi, I'm Andrea Metcalf, and welcome to Put Your Money Where Your Mouth Is, where we're paying people $10 for every pound they lose. We have eight different trainers. One of them may be the one for you, and eight clients, one may be just like you, who are trying to lose 30% of their total body weight over the next three months. This isn't just about them, though. We're going to bring you healthy living tips from pets, lifestyle, and food to really helping you get fit fast. I'm Andrea Metcalf. Let's check out how the first week went. For this week one, we are um, doing primarily just focusing on um, endurance type training, more so cardio, and just getting a better feel for Nicole in general. We wanted to work on her stamina first, just because we realized she was a former swimmer, and she hasn't been doing, you know, she's been sedentary for a very long time. So we want to work on her stamina and endurance before we got into any kind of weight training or anything like that. This, uh, this first week has uh, given us some time to really get to know Nicole and uh, work with some of her injuries such as plantar fasciitis, um, which is a um, little bit of heel pain right there. And um, some other things we are also working with is um, a little bit of hip, uh, hip flexor tightness as well. Uh, we have Nicole on the Chicago chocolate diet. What it consists of is two meal replacement shakes a day. It's high protein, high antioxidants, and then she also has these chocolate squares throughout the day that she snacks on as well too. So this week they're telling me that I'm going to be working out twice a day, one with each of them. So obviously that's an overwhelming um, thought, but I'm also really excited uh, and I think they're each going to push me in different ways and so that's a really great opportunity for me. Uh, with Jamie, uh, this first week, the thing that she really focused on was running, which is probably one of my least favorite things um, on the whole planet. Um, so that was a big challenge, but it also kind of showed me how she's going to push me and beyond even where I think I can go. I'm on the Chicago Chocolate Diet, and that includes two meal replacement shakes, and then I get one uh, healthy meal during the day, and then I can have uh, chocolate squares when I'm feeling hungry during the day. I have noticed I'm having more energy when I wake up in the morning. It's easier to wake up. Um, obviously, with all the working out, I'm getting tired, but definitely when I wake up in the morning, it's easier to get out of bed. Um, when we get on the scale this week, we really don't know what to expect, but um, from what we've gotten this, this week alone, I mean, I, I think it's going to be good results. Yeah, she's really, I mean, we've pushed her. She's been pushing really hard. We, you know, have her on a great program, so I think it'll be really great results. I'm not, not too worried with her. Hi, I'm Andrea Metcalf with your healthy food tip of the day. You know, Brussels sprouts are a great little vegetable that are packed with calcium and fiber. And for only 8 to 10 calories a piece, you can have so many of them. The first thing you should know about Brussels sprouts is you should always cut off the bottom of them before cooking them. One way to get my family to eat them is I have them, then open them up onto a cookie sheet sprinkle salt and pepper over them, and even a little bit of either balsamic vinegar or lemon zest. This is one of my favorite tools, just right over the top. I roast them in the oven for about 15 minutes at 375. Now, Brussels sprouts have become very chic, and you'll see them in high-end restaurants in salads. So how do you prepare them? First, start by, again, cutting off the nub, and then put them in a bowl, about six to 10, with a little bit of water, Put it in the microwave for about two minutes. They'll turn bright green. From there, you're going to take a spoon and just press them open. By pressing them open, all the leaves come apart and you can make them into a beautiful little salad, which is what I've done over here. Now, you just don't want a Brussels sprout salad. Add some condiments, like maybe mini cucumbers sliced around the top, and to stabilize that blood sugar, add some protein. Either grill it up yourself or buy pre-packaged grilled cooked chicken. Add a few bites and a little bit of dressing, and you've made yourself a very healthy lunch or dinner with Brussels sprouts. This is your healthy food tip of the day, and I'm Andrea Metcalf. Stay tuned for more healthy living tips and checking in with our trainers.